What's up guys? It's Mike D for Life here. Just wanted to do a little uh update. I wanna do I just did the uh because I watched uh A American's videos. Shout out to A American. Uh he inspired me to uh paint my first rifle. Um you know. So I'm one of the people who use the rifle, it doesn't really matter, I wanna make my own, so I don't have anybody that has a white rifle with one, but this is just kind of an update of what I got going on here. So I just I did the camo on this my Rifle here. This is a. Uh, I got it. I got a arrow blim upper um, a while back. Arrow precision and a uh, PA multi caliber blim palmetto PA 15 lower. And I built this out. Uh, I'm kind of tall, so I had to put a uh, nine position buffer tube on it, so it goes back a little farther. Um, and it's a 16 inch one and nine it's a heavy barrel um yeah and uh got a little one to four cheaper uh lpvo so i'm just kind of buying stuff for the first time but i did the camo here and um this is what it worked out some of them turned out really well this one turned out really well some of them did really well this is the first time i ever camoed anything um but yeah so um i mean to me it looks good this is you know I finally got my Surefire uh, dual switch in here so that, you know, I got the pressure pad and then switch. Uh, that's that uh, KE2 dual fuel, dual fuel. It takes the 18650s. The little CR123 batteries, they go out in like an hour. Um, I got 18650s in this and I can lay this down. This will light up a hundred yards or more, light up the neighborhood. It's almost more than you need. And, uh, I can lay it down and it'll run for six hours on an 18650. So I can put an extra battery in here and I can walk all night long with a, a torch on the end of it. So yeah, I wouldn't, that's the best thing. I would never buy another light with those CR123 lights. They, I don't, I don't enjoy them. Uh, and yeah, this is my TP9 double action. Holds 18 and one, they got the bottle with the laser. That's a good gun. Got my Springfield, Springfield XDS uh, Mod 2 with a red dot. Let's see if we can get that in there. Yeah, we get that in there. And it's got the, uh, yeah, I like that gun. That's a really nice gun. And I just picked this up. This is an expensive little bastard here. Excuse my language. This is a six hour 238. And I got really big hands and I can, I can still hold this gun and shoot it comfortably. Um, it's a 380. It's the, two-tone um man the magazines for this gun are fifty dollars it's got the uh sig um sig light tritium night sights which are really nice um the guy i got it from before tried to polish it which it was like a matte finish so uh i think it kind of you know didn't really look right so if i wanted to i might have it bead blast so i can send it back to sig and get it uh bead blasted that's more of a female's gun um but the guys at my local pawn shop and the gun shop i was talking to says that they've had experiences with these that coming off so they wouldn't recommend anybody that's not used to a 1911 being cocked and locked not to carry this gun so it wouldn't be good for my daughter to start with but still worth a good little penny so um yeah but shoots awesomely i mean i can't hit the broad side of a barn with it but shoots well uh, but yeah, I just wanted to give a little quick update on my uh, My camo shot out to a American. Um, I think it turned out really well um, Yeah, and, and just as advice from anybody nobody really watched my videos But the best investment I made was buying the CM CCMG 22 conversion kit to where I shoot 22s and you know, I can't I'm not fortunate enough to be able to shoot 556 five, or 223 I got a bunch of it put up, but I am fortunate enough to be able to go through a you know 350 325 box of that federal auto match once a week and teach my kids to shoot so that 22 uh conversion kit's about the best thing that uh i've invested in a long time and it does really well with a one and nine twist um i've had a lot of people say that it doesn't have accurate it's not accurate or anything but i have tremendous accuracy with the uh, one and nine twist with the federal auto match so all right everybody pray for america F. Joe Biden and uh, 
Yeah, hanging in adults have your guns. Just teach your kids to train. Train your kids to shoot. It doesn't matter if we have these guns. If the people we pass them down to don't know how to use them. So, everybody, have a blessed day. Mike D for Life, out.